but for this tutorial we are going to use a tool called google map customizer so type in your google search google map customizer or simply click on the link in the description below so this is the interface of the website we have a lot of options so if you want to style this google map you can here go and choose from these different styles for example this one if you want and you have also the possibility to export this map but for this tutorial we are we are more interested in getting the, the satellite map so to add this base map you have here satellite map click on it and now we have a google map satellite image you can see here that the resolution is very high and from here we are going to download this image but in order to do this we are going to use a google chrome extension you can also use firefox so to get more information about this you can click on how to use and you will get all the information about this website and here you can see that in order to download your satellite image you need to get fireshot plugin for firefox or fireshot for chrome or adobe acrobats pdf toolbar so here you will have a clickable link click on it and you will be redirected to this home page of, of this extension so here you will have the possibility to install it we'll have your install button right here but for me i already installed this extension so i don't have that button i have the remove from chrome because i already have it so after installing this extension you will get the possibility to take a screenshot of your of your map so after the download of your extension you will get you will get it here under your extensions so let's imagine let's imagine for example that i want to take this extension so i will close this window and i will take this part of my image I will click on my extension and I will select capture selection and I will select this part so this this new tab will open automatically with my caption here and from here I have the possibility to save this caption as an image to do this click on save as image then navigate to where you want to save your image and then click save so if you get back to your work folder you will find that your image successfully downloaded so you can see here that the resolution is quite high so i hope that you got some useful information from this tutorial if so please like it and subscribe if you want to get more tutorials